If not replaced on time, cabin air filters can make you sick. Stay with us and we'll explain why. Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair Guys. Today will be super helpful video guys. To any of you that have a dot charger, you need to remove or replace cabin air filter. Stay with us, we will explain where it's located, how to get to it and why it's super important to replace it. Most people will not replace it and that can actually make you sick. We will explain why you may experience symptoms such as allergies, headache, sore throat if you're being stuck in a car for a long time just because of an, a cabin air filter most people will not replace it on time and it's an item that costs a few dollars and it can uh, drastically improve the quality of the air and it can make you uh, actually feel better in your vehicle as well before we start let me tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here at the garage we try to make guys at least two to three hundred free repair videos on that dot charger we'll have even more why we do that because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need guys in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these free videos absolutely free and if you guys need to buy any parts tools for your dot charger or any car you want to get them at a good price and quick shipping you want to save money check out the link in the description of the video below that's where we get all our or two supplies from and uh, we'll share where you can find even additional things so what we have specifically here 2018 dodge guys doesn't matter if you have a v6 v8 it will work as well that specifically is a 3.6 quite common engine so if you come right here okay on the left side you have that cap that you need to remove by pressing two taps and just pull it out now when you come right here okay what do you have you have one cap okay right there that you're going to lift up check this thing out you lift it up like that right and when you do that check out the, the filter goes like that the arrow points towards the back so when you install the new one it needs to uh, follow that way too and now all we have to do just grab and pull that filter out now let's talk why it's important to replace it uh, quite often and how it can affect your health that car has only 41,000 miles that dot uh, has only 41,000 miles check the inside of the filter it's terrible guys all that is dirt dust stuck so that's okay really really bad stuff you can see right there you breathe that stuff it makes you sick what it could be there it could be allergens uh, you can cause allergies mold spores uh, actually uh, road pollutants and all that stuff it's recommended to replace it quite often guys we have a video on the channel that explains how often to change cabin air filter we always recommend to get the one with the carbon activated carbon so that way it can clean the air more i usually get a four layer filter the four layer filters are amazing uh, you have uh, two layers of uh, carbon activated uh, uh, activated carbon you have another layer and uh, uh, you, some of them come even with baking soda where it kills bad, uh, bad smells and things like that. Hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you needing help with that. Putting it together is in reverse order we took it apart. Thank you for watching and see you next time.